Milo Jasper here, and we got another spooky scary game today. It is, I can never pronounce the bird's name. Bird is the word's nest. This was made by a, uh, by a person that made this game in a week that apparently had no experience in making games ever before. And if it's anything like this right here, the drawing, it's going to be good. It's Garden, Garden of Ban Ban Reincarnated. So they took, it even says it right here. This is a fan-made project by Unique Geese and is not affiliated with the original series Garden of Ban Ban. So they used the game and they made it a fan-based version of how they saw it, I guess. How they would have made it. And again, this, I keep wanting to say director and director is not the word. Uh... People who make games. Developer! There we go. The developer, never made games before, made this game in a week, and I think we should give it a shot. I already like the noises that it makes, so let's see what we have in store. I'm pretty excited. You're going to make more chapters, too? Okay. I like that it's the same thing. Ooh, I glitched. I like that it's the same thing. Ooh. I'm already freaked out. <laughs> All right. Can I, how do, do we interact the same? I can't leave. Is that the outside? Can I come into the out now? Oh, I already want to leave. I'm scared. This is already very scary. How did I get in here? Why am I in here? Is this like kind of based on the original game? Is that supposed to be uh, Stinger Flynn? Lend a helping hand. I'm not even moving the mouse. That is my character swaying back and forth on its own. Nice. And there's there was an accident that happened here. Or they spilt paint after doing all this. So Bam Bam, Jumbo Josh, Bambolina, the bird is the word. Stinger Flynn, oh, something fiddles, I think. I don't remember. Uh, Reed, the teacher. Screw you, teacher. If you could dream it, you could do it. Did you steal that from Disney? From the part? This is the exact same desk and everything. Can I read this? Ban Ban OS, a fatal error has occurred. Project Rebirth has automatically closed, please contact your ad administrator or contact the research on floor 2A in the testing sector. Failure to report this error now result in termination. Error 4ADC1022. There's a lot more detail in this one already. Who are you? Jumbo Josh says, eat fruits and veggies to grow strong. So you're, these are a lot more cartoony, and the blood scares me a little bit. Do we get, uh, for the safety of a child, please check in at the front desk. I don't have a child, I don't think. Ooh. Share your smile. Let's play. No. That, that said no. At the beginning of the game was the same as this, right? Like, guard a baby it the cafeteria is to the right. It's so dark. Is that a flashlight? Uh, it's a flashlight. F for flashlight. I hope this lasts a long time. And this can hardly see nothing. Eat plain foods. Bread, cream, white, white sauce? White sauce. Like cheese dip? Keep your body ticking. Huh. Oh, who's this? Jumbo Josh? I guess I wasn't... Oh, oh, those fall. I didn't like it anyway. What's this? I gained something. I don't know what it was. Okay. Rob, consider this my letter of resignation. In my 27 years of being a cook, I have never had such a miserable experience. There is no other kitchen staff, so cooking, cleaning, planning, everything.
everything was up to me. The only thing I wasn't in charge of was ordering supplies, so I was cooking the same thing every day. These kids are going to get sick. There is no nutrients in the food we serve. I don't even know how this is legal. Not to mention the kids being so brutal and mean. Jumbo Julie is not exactly a flattering name. I know I'm overweight, but I can't help. I can't handle hearing it. It's so, so, zoo, so, zoo. Times a day. Screw you, Rob. Screw Jumbo Josh. And screw this school. Julie Winters. Jumbo Julie Winters. Well, we no longer have a cook. Oh, there we go. So, we had a female cook that said, screw you, I quit. And now we no longer have a cook. Shame. Okay. Oh, I have a card now. Can I go in here now? Hey, I like the ding. Ooh, do I get a drone? Can I have the keys? I can have the keys. Can I have the drone? I can't have the drone. Maybe I get the drone after I find the remote. Is this a paper? Oh, Kindergarten Daycare Center Repair Request Form. Third floor, Tech and Repair Sector. Please fill out this form to the best of your ability and send to the repair sector. Failure to report broken equipment could result in fines up to $200 and termination. Jeez, this place really likes to terminate people. I've read termination three times now. Two times. Uh, today's date, September 12th, 2016. Uh, date of incident, the same day. Uh, what item were damaged? Drone, remote. Remote already sent. So we gotta find the remote somewhere else. What happened? What do you mean? My drone stopped working after hitting the button in the something hall, main hallway. I've already sent down my remote, but the drone is in the supply closet in the lobby, awaiting pickup. Is the item uh, crucial to your job? Yes. Janitorial do services, I guess that says? Uh, what days do you normally work? Monday through Thursday, 6 to 4, Friday 1 to 9. I would actually really like that schedule. Uh, signature, Josh Binkley? Berkeley? Berkeley. We're gonna say Berkeley. Employee ID. I hope I don't need to remember that. That's why I'm recording, so I can see this later. Just in case I can't read it after I recorded. 6498217. Just in case. And advisor signature, Stephen Adams. With no notes. Okay. You have to double click to make the dude start moving again. Or girl. Who? Oh. Accidents happened here. Can I go in here? Ooh, I can go in here now. Okay, I guess that's what the key was for. I don't think I need to do anything else in here unless I missed any paperwork on the chairs and I don't see any. No, okay. Ooh, where am I going? Over here. Adventure! Oh, I hate that. That's the glass doing that. Okay. Where are the lights? Oh! Oh, is that a person? Is this a person? That's a person, because that's a hand on the wall. Oh, that's a person! That's a person? That was a person. I saw a hand. That was a person. There's a lot of blood here. I don't enjoy this. Just like the first game. Kind of. But I don't have my drone. Oh, you appeared out of nowhere. Did I just randomly gush blood out? <laughs> okay. Random chairs. Any any notes? Could I? Okay. But I need the screwdriver. I want the screwdriver. Oh, I do I need to read this? Group A. All those names. All those names. That's what you're doing during those schedules. Subscribe. <laughs> Oh, way to, way to, to put yourself in there. It's very smart. Subscribe to Unique Geese on YouTube. Very smart to do, friend. Uh, you should subscribe to me as well for playing this person's game because so far this is, I hate to say it, the, the, the detail is so much better than the original game. But I haven't fully 
actually played this game yet, so I can't say yes or no yet. Uh, where are you from? Cat. I'm from Cat. Cat Fever Town. That's where I'm from. I like where that kid puts down. Okay. Oh! Seed of Crouch. Why do I need this now? Okay. Someone whistling? Okay. Hey, chicks! Welcome to my nest. Before you enter, please take off your shoes and put them in the slots on the left. Be sure to follow the rules and have fun. Well, thank you. Oh, it's music. Right? Is that what I was hearing? Do I need to take my shoes off? I'm not taking my shoes off. Breaking the rules. Why is this so good? Oh, I run a lot faster. Rules! No running, I just ran. No shoes, I have shoes on. No bare feet, ask your teacher for socks if needed. Always check in with your teacher if you've been in the pipes for a long time. Do not enter restricted or in construction areas. No yelling, no fighting. Don't poop on the floor, Josh. Uh, have fun! Bring a friend when meeting Opal the bird. Do not... Do not... Something the eggs. Ta do not take the eggs. I'm taking the eggs. There are eggs here. I already see an egg. It's mine. Mine. Haha, <laughs> took the eggs. What are you gonna do about it? Uh-oh! Opal lost her eggs! It's not Opal, but I can't I don't know how to pronounce her name. Can you find all six of Opal's pretty blue eggs? Put the eggs back in their nest for an amazing surprise. Here you go. So I need five more. Oh. This music's already addicting. Can I crawl under there? I can. Ha <laughs> ha. Must be a small bean. So that was two. Oh. So I need two more. I love this. Oh, this would be a good place to hide one. Or not. My game said no. You're not allowed to crawl through the tubes. Okay. I won't crawl through the tubes then. Okay, I need two more. Can I go through this tube? I can! I really like the music! <laughs> I really like the music. Okay. Share your smile. There's even blood back here! I'll go this way. Are those eyes? Those are eyes. Are those eyes? They remind me of the robots in FNAF security. Oh, no, that was the bird. That was the bird. I saw a beak. That was a bird. I can't run while I crouch. That's not cool. Pretty bird, pretty bird, pretty bird, pretty bird, pretty bird. Lots of pretty birds. Well, thank you for leaving an egg. Thank you for... Where did you go? If this room is completely boxed in, where did you go? I don't in, I, nope, oh, I ran. I didn't mean to run. I meant to crouch. I, 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 oh, I don't, I don't like that logic. I don't like that logic that you just disappear whenever you want. That's not cool. And I apologize. My nose is running and itchy at the same time. But no, I'm, I'm not, I'm not okay with that. I'm not okay with that at all. And I'm not okay with not being able to run while you crouch. I, I don't like that. Okay, who else is... Who else am I going to run into? Is it just going to be... It's not Opal, but your name's now Opal. What is that? Are those eyes? Those look like eyes. 
they're gonna oh okay that's my reflection and what are the random white things on the wall X marks the spot can I do something here can I uncrouch no okay there's something here yes it's a bird! It's the bird. It's a pretty bird. Okay. I don't like the eyes, but you drew some pretty cool eyes. You did really good. But I'm creeped out. I also like the fact that I'm allowed to walk in these tubes, so thank you so much. I enjoy that very much. I did not enjoy the fact that there was a bird on the other side, but that's fine. But say, did I see that? I did see that. Okay. Let me turn around. Make sure it's not randomly. I really want to know where the bird went. It was an inc. Never mind. Forget it. This music's too happy to worry about anything. It kind of reminds me of Banjo Kazooie. Can I have the screwdriver now? Is that what this is too? Is the screwdriver? The music kind of reminds me of Banjo Kazooie. <laughs> Give it. Open vents with your screwdriver. You know, I didn't think that far ahead of what I would need the screwdriver for. That makes a lot of sense. But now, also, um, uh, I have PTSD with vents because of, uh, Poppy Playtime? Just saying? Where's a vent? That was a vent, but that opened up to a key card. Oh. Scratch that. I know where I'm going. I'm not excited about this. I'm not excited about this one bit. I swear, Puggy just turns around and... Or the bird. Or Jumbo Josh, because Jumbo Josh is at the end of the game, if this is mimicking the other game. Because it has so far been mimic. Oh, okay! It's been mimicking the game quite a lot so far. Like, where the rooms are laid out, and the playground and everything. But I don't remember falling through... Well, it ended right there anyway, so never mind. Okay, am I still crouched? I'm still crouched. Well, I was too heavy. I'm not a kid, so that makes sense. I was probably, I'm probably an adult. I was probably too heavy to do any of that. Listen to your superior. You are nothing. Man, Ban Ban's, I, I'll be honest, I thought that was Batman for a second. <laughs> like a very cartoonish Batman because of the, where his party hats are. <laughs> okay, Ban Ban's a jerk. Got it. Understood. Can I have the playful music back? I'd be less scared if I had the playful music back. Is there anything over here that I should be... Can I climb? Can I climb? Can I jump? I have a jump! I didn't know I had a jump this whole time. I don't think I jumped any during this. I love the face, though. I love the Ban Ban face. He looks like an adult. Can I go? I want up here. Am I allowed? Is there anything up here? That's a negatory. Okay, I'm not. It doesn't want me up there, so I'm, I'm not going to go up there. That's fine. Didn't see anything else that I missed. I don't think I missed anything. If I did, put it in the comments and be like, Milo! You dum dum, go get some gum gum. You missed that. Ooh, do I gotta? What up? I hate platformers. Is it nothingness? Oh, it's nothingness. Okay, I hate it. I was scared I was gonna fall and die right there. Okay. Eee, there's paper. What's that? Opal's next nest expansion progress. On September 12th. Everything's happening on September 12th, 2016. What is so significant about that day? I bet it's the developer's birthday. Developer, if you ever watch this, is that what it is? Is it your birthday and that's why you picked that date? 
I, I want to know why that date is so particular. Or is it actually involved in your version of the game? They're probably never going to see this video, but I'd love to know. The new expansion to Opal's Nest has been successful so far. As requested, we're installing the new playground piping before working at the ball pit. Ah, ball pit! We've also got a team working on the new hallway that connects the classrooms to the new area. The kids should be able to climb from the current play area into the new one via the pipes, but the hallways will be an alternate route to the new area. The overnight crew installed some platforms that the kids will be able to climb into when the ball pit went in the ball pit. But I have to wonder, how did they even manage to install them? Of course, we don't actually put the balls in until we have all the construction done, but that pipe seems to go on forever. I know, there's lower levels to the facility that I haven't seen before, but how is it even possible to have a pit that deep? What else is down there, and why are we covering it in thousands of plastic balls? I've noticed sometimes it's better not to question stuff here, so I'm just going to keep my mouth shut, but uh, better to ju better to just my better to just do my job and go home. Regardless, the new area should be finished in a couple of weeks, assuming we don't run into any other mishaps. So you've already ran into some mishaps? Don Doug Doug Don Doug Don Doug construction supervisor. Okay. So, oh, I don't actually pick that up. It just stays there forever. It stays there forever. Got it. So, this pit is supposed to be filled with plastic balls. And it's a ginormous pit. Into despair, apparently. Whew, I thought I fell to my death right there. Okay. Am I supposed to eventually climb all... Oh, nope, there's a vent. Let me make sure there's not anything over here I'm missing. No. Anything over here I'm missing. No. Oh, oh, I can't. Okay. More vents! Yay! <sighs> I think I also read that the developer liked Batum and FNAF, so they they understand scary games. Don't go right. Right's always correct, right? Maybe? Never mind. Both of them were, cre were correct answers. You fooled me. Oh, we're back in the... No. This way. Oh, no! Oh! I forgot to uncrouch. Insert lore here! <laughs> it even stole, stole the coin drop sound from the other game. Ah! <laughs> uh, okay! Understand! Uncrouch! Whatever. Oh! Yep. <laughs> I did not run. I, I, I'm still in shock at the bird shaking me. That, that was a daggone good bird. I jumped again. Okay, this game is different whenever you jump. Where does it put me whenever I die? I promise I'll eventually get this. Now I know to uncrouch and run. I don't know where I'm running, but I'm running. Okay. Stop. Jump. 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 There we go. Okay. Oh, hey. Flashlight. <laughs> that might be helpful. I don't know if I'll need it. Can I just walk? Dagnabbit, no. And I can't run while crouched. I forgot. Let's go to the left this time. See what happens. Nothing. Nothing happens. Because it's the same route. The developer wanted to make you think you were making a decision. Whenever really, all decisions give you the same conclusion. Smart. Okay, we're gonna uncrouch. <laughs> running. I'm running. I don't know where I'm running to, but I'm running. Get to the door. What door? There's no door there! Uh, 
Now that I've seen the bird again, that is a lot scarier. You can see her rib cage. Like she's been starving. I don't, and her, her eyes are gone. I don't... I like that. That's scarier, but I don't like it because it's scary. You get what I mean? You get what I mean. There we go. There we go. Flashlight. Interact. There we go. Crouch. Okay. They didn't want to uncrouch me until she started running at me. Unfair. Developer, the only complaint I have so far is the crouching. I can't run when I crouch. Like, and I can't, during a cutscene, get up from the crouch, which you can't fix. It's meant to do that. I just want to complain about it. Hi! I'm running. Don't listen to that sign. Who are you? Who are you? There's no door there. Oh, no. Ah! I hate mazes. I hate mazes. Maybe I'm not supposed to follow the pink text. This is definitely not in the first game. But the chase scene, I like the chase scene. Chase scene is a nice touch. I do like the chase scene. Although I have a feeling I'm going to die multiple times now. But I am really liking this game. And I hate to say it, but I'm, I'm kind of liking it more than the original Ban Ban game. And I hate saying that, because I, I feel they're both really good games. The styles that they're using, let me put it that way. The styles that they're using, they're both really good games. So, I was supposed to say, I was running, I thought I was not. Okay, I crouched again. That was my fault. They're both good games. This one's got a lot more detail art-wise in it. It's put more thought into, like, this villain, which I very much enjoy. Or the bad guy. Whatever this thing is called. Bird. Oh. Oh, it's putting me back at the very beginning of the game for, like, a split second. I guess that's where the game drops you before it, like, makes you die in that spot. Okay. Okay. Makes sense. And I also like that I can hear myself run. That is nice. Oh. What did I do? <laughs> I walked the wrong direction. Sorry. I am liking this game. This game is very well thought out. Well, okay. Okay. It's very well thought out based on another game. I like it. I don't want to sound like I'm insulting the people that made the original Ban Ban. Because that was a good thought. That was a good game. Like, a thought out game. And the direction that's going towards. So. We're going this way this time. She's just hungry. I can tell. She doesn't know what she's doing. This is too fast paced for me. Ah, she glitched right there. How is that fair? Where am I running to? What's GV Infinity? What's GV Infinity? Oh, I'm at the dead end again! Oh, hey! 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 What? What? Hey! Wait, wait. What did I just do? What did I just do? Did I just break the game? I like how they put that together. Yes! Yes! Thank you for playing. Check out the game that was made by Unique Geese on the YouTube channel. If you want to watch and see how they made it, they put it on their YouTube channel. Go give them a follow. I'm about to give them a follow after this. That was good. 
I liked that game. I had a blast working on this project. In less than a week, I went from zero game experience to a working game. Holy cow. Holy cow. Kudos. I loved that. That was good. If you didn't catch it at the end, it looked like a ginormous frog. Well, no. Let me, let me start over. It looks like a skull character. It looks like a... It looks... Fred, come over here. It looks like a Beauregard in a frog suit. That's what it looked like. And it also had a chef hat on. And apparently, in this version of the game, Jumbo Josh is the chef. Kudos. Kudos. I very much enjoyed that. That was great. This was good. This was good. I... And I just played Bam Bam, Garden of Bam Bam Part 2 yesterday. It got more lore of the story. That took two hours for me to play. I'm just bad at video games. Just saying. It's not a two hour game. I'm just bad at games. But I this one had more detail. This one has good, fun, be, upbeat music. It made me feel like I was in a like daycare center. With And then randomly there's pipes everywhere. I very much liked that. I very much liked that. And I really liked the chase scene. I really... Okay, well, in Bam Bam Part 2, Bambolina chases you. But it's much more slower pace, and it's not as... It's almost like a straight shot chase scene. Like, there's two places you can choose the wrong path. This, you choose wrong multiple times, and it's a very fast pace. I liked that. I liked that a lot. If you liked it... Give it a thumbs up. Give the video a thumbs up. If you hated it, give it a thumbs down. I highly suggest you go to this uh, person's YouTube. Go give them a follow. Unique Geese. I'm going to go give them a follow right after I finish recording this video. That was awesome. That was fantastic. Thank you all for watching. See you all in the next video. Bye-bye!